You guys hear me? Yeah, we got you. Okay, first question, Isaac. Dawson, how different is it playing in the Smith Center in tonight's environment versus the environment when you played in the Smith Center last year? Oh, I mean, it's a lot different just because of the fans. So it was really, it was really fun tonight. Uh, Hunter. Yeah, Dawson. So on this team, you're sort of the microcosm of playing inside and out. And early in the second half today, you guys were really dominating inside, which sort of opened up uh, the three-point game for everyone else. Caleb specifically, uh, you knocked down a couple of big shots. Uh, how do both of those parts of the offense complement one another and help you guys uh, score as efficiently as you guys did the second half tonight? Yeah, I think it really just uh, goes to whatever the defense gives us. You know, we had an advantage inside. Uh, they were having a trouble guarding us inside, so we were going at them. And then next thing you know, we're in a pick and roll situation. Boom, we pop. That's a three. And you know, if they if they um, run towards me or whoever's popping, then the guard is going to be able to get downhill or be open for a three. Greg Barnes. Hey, Dawson. Uh, Armando spoke to us a few minutes ago and talked about there being kind of a, a passion to get back on the court after what happened up in Connecticut and play a good team and really show that uh, you guys are a better team than what you showed up there. Is Was that something you guys have talked about as a team and really focused on this past week to, to really prove doubters wrong? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I, th I think it really all started uh, a big change honestly, um, in a positive direction. The season started in practice yesterday. We had, we had our best practice of the year yesterday. And so we all knew what we were going to come in here and do tonight. And I don't see us looking back at all. Thank you. Brendan. Hey, Dawson. Yeah, just sort of curious. Something that Coach Davis had mentioned a few times during the summer and into the season is, is you guys learning to enjoy each other's success and to actually, you know, have joy playing together. And it certainly looked like you had a lot of it tonight. Just wondering, as someone who just joined the program this offseason, how have you learned and how have the rest of the guys learned to sort of be happy for each other when they have success? You know, it's quick. You know, we have a at this level, you know, there's a respect level for everyone when you step in the locker room just because we know uh, how hard we work as individuals. So um, when, you, when you see someone have success, you see all the hours that they put in the gym. So you can't really do anything but uh, feel good for them. Michael Coe. Hey, Dawson. So I asked Armando about uh, your scoring tonight and he called you a microwave. Is, is that sort of how you see uh, yourself in this team? Someone who can just heat up uh, in the blink of an eye? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, I just stay ready so I don't have to get ready. I just think that um, um, kind of like how you describe, like I think I can get it going at any point in time. Thank you. C.L. Brown, go ahead. Hey, Dawson, I hate to keep harping on Connecticut and, and bringing up the play there, but it but it seems like it's still kind of in the back of, of everybody's mind. Um, it, it, what was the difference coming into this night in the preparation between this and those games in Connecticut? Like, do you feel because of those games, you might have been a little bit more focused and, a, you know, a little bit more urgent tonight? Yeah, I think uh, maybe uh, we got punched in the mouth, you know, in, ten in Tennessee and Connecticut. And I think it was a big time wake up call that we all needed. And so I think ever since Connecticut, you know, we've been locked in in practice. Like I said, we had our best practice of the year, in my opinion, uh, yesterday. And I just like where uh, things are headed right now. All right, last one, Adam. Dawson, you've had some huge games this season uh, individually, and, you know, you've had some quiet games. You know, it's – I realize we're seven games in. It is, is this – very much a process of trying to pick your spots individually and seeing about where you can get your offense and when you can like make a play for someone else. Is that just the thing you're trying to continue to figure out? Yeah, for sure. Um, this team has a ton of weapons. Uh, we're super talented. And so, you know, some nights it's not going to be your night and uh, that's okay. All right, thanks, Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Dawson. Hey, Thanks.